TTE Naughty, KP, Case, the TTE Camp. What do Zay think about them falling out? And I got to be 100% honest. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> now, let me tell you why I don't give a fuck. I'm not just going to say I don't give a fuck and not tell you why I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck because I am an OTM nigga. Do you see this? Out the mud. OTM. This shit is on my skin. This shit is on my skin. You feel me? OTM is on the skin. Yeah. So, that's not my business. I'm not a TTE nigga. I am an OTM nigga. And I know y'all see me on the podcast with Naughty and shit, so that can get a little confusing. You know what I'm saying? Because that's still bro, though. So it can get a little confusing. Y'all think I'm a TTE nigga. No, I am an OTM nigga. My street business is completely different from their street business, from what they got going on outside of the podcast. They hang with each other way more than I hang with them outside of the podcast. So I don't know everything that's going on over there. Like I said, I'm not in a camp. I'm an OTM nigga. You know what I'm saying? All I'm doing is sitting back and watching this shit and hearing this shit for the first time like y'all. Well, not exactly for the first time, but all this shit still new to me like y'all, bro. Because KP wasn't speaking on this shit, and now he's speaking on this shit. Now, before I go any further, let me say this. It's a, it's a level of love that I'm going to always have for Naughty, bro. But a simple fact is, we, we started that shit together, bro. We was the first podcasters on Pop Austin Media. Naughty seen my interview from Pop Austin Media and then went and then he wanted to fuck with me. And said, yeah, bro. Uh, I need you. I, I seen your shit. You saying the same shit I'm saying. Let's start. I'm finna start this podcast, bro. I need you to be my co-host. I'm on like a podcast. I'm like, fuck your shit. Nigga, I be talking shit anyway. I do that shit for free anyway. Nigga, shit, fuck it. I, fuck it. Let's do it. So... That nigga showed me something different, bro. So for that, I'm going to always, you know what I'm saying, appreciate that. I'm going to always uh, salute you for that. But with, but with all that being said, nigga, I didn't fell out with Naughty a few times, bro. So I know where KP and them niggas coming from. I know Naughty, I know Naughty crazy, bro. I know Naughty can be tripping, bro. You know what I'm saying? And you really got to tell that nigga, bro. Naughty, bro, you tripping. Like, forcefully, you got to really, like, bitch, you tripping, ho. The fuck is wrong with you, nigga? Like, you know what I'm saying? He get to tripping, bro. So, but the shit that KP saying, no, this not no, just no, no tripping shit. This some deep ass shit, you know? KP saying that key snitch, uh, uh, naughty snitch don't keys. That's what they saying. That's what Keith, that's what TTE Keith and TTE KP is saying. They saying Naughty snitched on Keith. Now, when I spoke to them on the phone, I'ma tell, I'ma tell y'all the same thing I told them. Bro, I gotta see that paperwork. Y'all gotta go down there and get that. I gotta go down there to Travis County, whatever building y'all need to go to and go retrieve that. Uh, if y'all gonna be saying that, you know what I'm saying? We got to see that black and white on that. Uh, and that's just, that's what anybody, that's just how that go. That's just how that go. You got to see the black and white on that. Now, if I see that, then I, then my hands tied. I can't, I can't go against that. But until then, like I said, I'm neutral, bro. I fuck with Naughty. I fuck with KP. I fuck with Keith, bro. That's day business. I don't have nothing to do with that, bro. Them niggas ain't never done nothing, nothing to me, bro. KP and them niggas ain't never done nothing to me, bro, since I met them niggas, bro. Them niggas been real niggas with me. They ain't never done nothing to me. So I'm not falling out with them because Naughty fell out with them. That's not, that's not what's going on here. 
like I said, I'm neutral. I don't give a fuck. I'm just sitting back and watching this shit play out. Now, I also seen the shit that Hunto just came out and said earlier today. Hunto just came out and said, now nah, he put a burner to his head. Now, I don't know if I believe that. And let me tell you why. I don't think I believe that. First off, because the nigga ain't never, ever remotely even came close to did anything playing with me or nothing like that, bro. Never. Ever with no burner, nigga. Ever. So I don't know if he just uh, just uh, put burner the head. Like I said, I need to I need to have a I need to have a talk with Hancho. Because if he did put a burner to your head, if that is true, why was you still coming around? Why was you still screaming TTE? Nigga, if a nigga put a burner to my head, bro, that's it, nigga. If we not cool, we not gang, nigga. You was a op boy. You was fool, nigga. I'm finna beat the dog shit out you. And then burn you. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take you out there way past Elgin. Way past motherfucking, way out there in the country. Way deep down in two, off 290. And bury your bitch ass, boy. Ain't nobody finna ever put a burner to my head, bro. No. We don't even play like that. So... If that was true, why was you still hanging and fucking with Naughty, bro? If Naughty put a burner to your head. That's my question, bro. If Naughty put a burn if Naughty put a burner to your head, why the fuck was you still screaming TTE gang? Why was you still fucking with this man? That should have been the end of that right there. That should have been the end of that right there. That's just me personally. That's how I personally think about it. You know? But yeah. That's all I really got to say on this. Oh, I'm going to keep it short and sweet. But I said all that to say this, bro. Stop asking me about that shit. Stop coming on my shows on Mondays at 8. And I know I be late. Y'all get all my dick all in the comments. All oh, Zay, Lay, Zay, woo, woo, woo. Y'all know I'm on nigga time, bro. Come on, I'm a whole nigga. I'm black as hell. Y'all know I'm going to be late to the damn thing, man. Just sit back and wait. I'm going to get there when I get there, and I'm going to do the damn thing. You know what I'm saying? Just chill. I'm coming. But, yeah, on Mondays, bro, stop commenting that shit on my show. Stop asking me to speak on TTE shit on my show, bro. Because I am not a TTE nigga. I am an OTM nigga. This is my first and last time addressing this shit. Any other time you want to hear something else about this shit, nigga, you go ask KP, you go ask Keese, you go ask Hancho, or you go ask Naughty. Because that's who's involved with this shit. I don't have nothing to do with this shit. I don't know. When I leave the podcast, nigga, I go home. I fuck with my niggas. I fuck with OTM niggas. So, they business, I don't know, because I'm not around them 24-7 like that to know they business. So, stop spamming that shit on my show. Stop asking me about that shit on Instagram in my inbox. Y'all see I'm not replying to y'all. Y'all see I'm not replying to the shit, and y'all still bugging me about the shit. So, this is me addressing it. This is me giving y'all y'all itch. After this, leave me the fuck alone with this shit. Real talk. Real talk, man. And I'm off this hoe. Like I said, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. That shit is free. And it take five to ten seconds. Y'all got some questions? Y'all want y'all want to talk to Zay? Nigga, comment on my YouTube shit. I'm going to start whooping some more with y'all with y'all on here. I'm going to start talking with y'all some more like this on here, man. So if y'all want me to talk, bro, hit them comments. Subscribe. That shit is free, and it take five seconds. Let's go. OTMZ, gang.